it is totally Tita here and I am back with another unboxing and no it's not Tariba it is something slightly even better I'm so excited because it is Salem Moon's 25th anniversary this year and they have released amazing merchandise is but the bad part is it's not released in the States which means that the only way that I can get the merchandise is if I one live in Japan to buy it off eBay and pay flipper prices which I'm not going to I searched online and I was able to find a couple of um, shopping proxy services and the one that I used in order to get this box was from a site called from Japan and how from Japan works is that um, oh by the way I'll put the link down below but you find the item that you want to buy on a Japanese website and you send the link to them and they will buy the item for you so it's three simple steps. First step is you send them the URL and then they confirm and they tell you okay the price is gonna be this which is the price of the actual item. They're not charging you anything extra. So the price was 30,000 I think 520 yen somewhere around there which converts to about 255 USD which is pretty it's pretty it's not bad you know. I was, I was a little iffy because I haven't seen the purse in person but I saw a picture and I fell in love with the picture so I'm like okay I'm gonna try it and if this site works I can order more cute adorable stuff from Japan so I send them the money they purchased the item they send me a confirmation saying like hey we purchased the item and then when the item gets shipped to them they send me another email saying by the way we got the items and then third step is choosing your how you want the item shipped to you and it's really awesome because you can buy multiple items. They would consolidate all your packages together, all for the cost of $7. So for $7, you're basically asking them to like, hey, please go buy these items for me, which is not bad, right? Because you're not paying like five times the price that you would on eBay. And then um, whatever the cost of buying the items and having that item shipped to their warehouse does get added onto your bill. So I think to sh in Japan to ship this box to their warehouse was $3. So of course 300 yen was added to my bill, which is like two bucks. I'm okay with that, you know? So yeah, let's get started and see what I got. So when you open it, you get this and it is very nicely packed. to get off but this is pretty awesome look it came with a little um little pocket that you can use to just take out your package so this is what the bag looks like and let me get out my scissors they saran wrap this pretty good did I get the bag but they also gave me the original bag that it came in and sorry guys I know it's, it's mirrored but it's is it time meets Sailor Moon um this is a pretty awesome bag I love that it has all of her um magic wands on here I'm so excited for this guys I hope you guys find it just as cute as me but you guys look how amazing this bag is and it comes with its own dust bag is it not the cutest thing ever and it is so soft oh my gosh I'm super excited to use this this is the tag right here this is the official Sailor Moon bag from Samantha Vega sorry guys I'm just trying to get it to focus and then the inside wait for it seriously Oh my gosh. The inside has the cutest lining. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it has little Luna and Artemis print with little stars and moon. This is so adorable. And then you have a pocket here. And then you have two side pockets here and here. But this is a very, very awesome size bag. I mean, I can't wait to use it and 
for all you guys who want to just make sure you know that this is real leather so I know some people are very against it but honestly for the price it was $255 the same bag that they released five years ago was um, platter and it was also $250 but it was fake leather so I like that they did the little upgrade and they didn't increase the price I am so in love with this bag Okay, so I just want to give you guys a nice close-up look of the bag. I took all the tissue paper out and I attached the strap. It really is a gorgeous bag. So right here on top you have the crescent moon and it has very nice um, crystals. Let's see if I can get the focus. And then you have Samantha Vega, her logo right here. You have adorable cat ears. You have the outside pouch with the Luna Artemis lining inside, two side pockets, this side, and then this side, and in the back you have the strap which attaches at the middle, and it has a handle on top as well, and then two side handles, and you'll see right here that the straps are adjustable, so you can make it whichever length you want, and then the inside, it is a drawstring bag, and of course the magnetic closure. It is a pretty decent size. I mean you can fit all your necessities like makeup, cell phone, keys, sweater. I mean it's a really good travel bag. It has adorable lining inside as well. It has an inside pocket and you'll see that it has two patches. This mini patch inside and then this one right here. And this is a good quality patch. You can see with the foil stamp. So yeah, if you guys like my video, make sure to click the thumbs up button, subscribe, and comment down below, you know, what you guys thought. Have a wonderful day.